Hello, and thank you for watching this short order manager tip video. In this video, I want to cover what you should be looking for to keep your order manager clean and up to date. This video will be helpful to whoever is in charge of your day-to-day -day dispatching of jobs, production receiving, or finalizing orders. It's important to understand that every order that enters order manager, regardless of what happens to it, will need to be finalized when you've finished your processing. Almost all of your filters have been set up to work specifically with orders that are not finalized, so the longer orders sit without being finalized, the more cluttered your order manager will become. Some of the most common issues we see are brokered parts not being fully received, then completed and finalized, and also non-finalized resolutions, such as stopped or canceled orders. A quick way to see if you're not finalizing all of your orders is to choose the Not Finalized filter and select a view that will allow you to sort and group by created date. You can create a custom view for this or use a created one, such as cut time. Simply select a view like work order report, copy it, rename that view, and change the sorts and grouping. Once you're in a not finalized filter and have a view grouped by created date, it'll be fairly clear what orders have been missed in the finalizing process. For instance, today's date is February 13th, and we can see that not all orders are being finalized correctly because these orders are from November 25th. Depending on how many orders have been missed, this could take a little time to confirm the original order was sent and invoiced in your yard management system, and then finalize it in Order Manager. If the order was canceled, stopped, or replaced, you may want to confirm or adjust inventory before finalizing these orders. If you're prompted for a scheduled delivery date, simply hit Cancel and it will not apply one. You'll want to finalize orders in small portions, 5 to 10 at a time. Finalizing larger groups at once will take significantly longer and can cause a slowdown within your order manager. Continue this process of confirming and finalizing until you're caught up to current orders. Keep in mind that if you're using order manager daily and completing and finalizing all of your orders correctly, this process should show minimal leftover orders. If you find yourself with many orders needing cleaned up, you may not be fully processing orders correctly. If you see a lot of waiting on broker status parts, then you may need guidance in refining your brokered processing for order manager. If you're seeing a lot of canceled orders, then you need to focus on handling and finalizing your resolutions. If you're not completely sure how to handle your portion of order manager, that is exactly what our team is here for. We want you to be efficient and successful when using order manager, so do not hesitate to reach out to us for help. As always, easy suite support is available in the chat bubble to the bottom right. Feel free to ask for help at any time and someone will make sure you get the information you need. Thanks for watching.